Welcome back to STL TV Live. I'm Sarah Bernard, and still with me in the studio is Roseanne Weiss with the Regional Arts Commission. The RAC is having a conference called Rust Belt to Artist Belt at the Crossroads, and you are going to tell us all about what that is and who can attend and all. So, well, it's open to anybody who'd like to register. Okay, and um, it is about arts-based community development. So that's so exactly what we've been talking yes, about. Yes, exactly. Okay. So it's it's about that, and and the exciting part is that we have partners in Detroit and Cleveland where this this um, conference has happened before. So we did a conference in uh, 2010 in St. Louis, and they've been doing conferences for the last three years in Detroit and Cleveland. Okay. We've put those together. Okay, so you're going to have people coming from out of town. Yes. And are the, these are going to be artists, people who work in community development together, yes. right? Okay. So anybody, I mean, all kinds of creatives like architects and uh, urban planners and anybody who's working with community, community organizers, social workers. So again, it's cross-sector. Okay. So that conversation can happen in a really meaningful way. So what we're talking about, especially in St. Louis and in Rust Belt cities like Detroit and Cleveland and Pittsburgh and Philadelphia and right. cities like that, um, they share with St. Louis this, this sort of empty space, right? Mm -hmm. Abandoned buildings, okay. uh, abandoned warehouses. Empty space. Yes, exactly. <laughs> and, and, and land that, that has not been used. And w there are all kinds of creative ways to use that. So we'll have discussions about how the arts can spur the use of those kinds of spaces and help revitalize and regenerate neighborhoods in our cities. And you've got workshops all weekend. That's right. So That's tell right. us about some of the workshops. What are some of the highlights? So well, fr uh, Friday will look like a normal conference, right, okay. with, with concurrent sessions on all kinds of topics. Mm -hmm. So we will have some, some architects who will be talking about um, uh, ideas for um, empty spaces okay. and reuse. And um, a lot of people who are very interested in not tearing down things, but keeping them and reusing them and revitalizing them. So for instance, there's an artist here in town who works with Old North St. Louis, and um, they've been renovating a building. And he will open that building this summer as a community center with arts programs going on. People, if somebody in the neighborhood wants to teach knitting, they can do it in that space. Um, so will he be there to talk about that? He will be that? there and to talk use it about as an that. example for the exactly. other cities. Okay. And I'm very excited. Um, there's somebody coming from Los Angeles. There's a project called the Watts House Project, okay. where it's a neighborhood near the Watts Tower mm -hmm. in which it's been arts infused without, di without displacing the people that live there. Okay. So training them to work in art, training them to rehab their houses, training them to work with artists in very meaningful ways. Okay, great. So uh, people here in St. Louis can sign up for this uh, workshop um, at a web, is there a website? Yes, there is. Okay. It's rustbelttoartistbelt.com. Rustbelttoartistbelt.com. It's there on the screen right now, or you can call 863-5811 for more information. Coming up April 12th to the 14th, so in about a month. Right. Okay, and it's a three-day, two-day? Yes, so it's two and a half days. We start on Thursday evening. We go all day Friday okay. and all day Saturday. Um, we'll have a speaker on Saturday, and then we're going to do something really interesting called open space technology. And what's that all about? Everybody makes their own conference. So what that means is we have rooms and we have times. And if okay. we didn't talk about what you want to talk about, you can create a session okay. on the spot, and wow. you announce it to everyone. And so we I've get seen people this to come together exactly. and talk about what's of interest to you. Exactly. And you've got a great uh, closing event on Cherokee Street. Yes, Is that we're right? very okay. excited about this. Um, you know, Cherokee. If you've been to it lately, um, it's a really good example of grassroots artists coming, creating spaces um, without displacing, you know, it's a really great mix. So it's exactly what you're talking about, yes. is bridging the community with the artists, and it's right. happening right here in St. Louis on That's Cherokee right. Street, That's so it's a right. great opportunity to show it off That's right. to all these people from out of town and also to our own citizens who may or may not have visited recently. That's right. So Cherokee Street, well that sounds like so much fun. And Roseanne, we are running out of time, but I really want to thank you for being with us. And we want to look one more time at the screen uh, for more information. Um, their Rust Belt, let's see. It's Rust Belt to ArtistBelt.com. Dot com, 863-5811. Perfect. So if you have any more information, viewers can um, look at the website or call the phone number. 
And um, again, thank you so much for coming and sharing with us. It sounds like just in a very exciting weekend, exciting for St. Louis. And remember to keep up with STL TV and all the great events going on around St. Louis. Friend us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for all the latest information. And you can always watch us streaming live on stltv.net. And when we return, we will be joined by Ellen Gautier, the artistic coordinator for the magical show Cavalia. So stay tuned. Thank you.